Hello, producer, and welcome now to Thursday. Well, sunny and professional today for the Tauri, though there may be some fears that bubble up in a couple of areas. The moon, which of course is the focus of our motion, still in Aquarius today and conjuncting Neptune. Neptune is the DSL modem that logs us into the light, so emotionally you're going to be very intuitive. Your guardian agents will be speaking through your heart if you listen. If you get a good feeling about something, follow it. If you get a bad feeling, follow it and see why, what they're trying to tell you, and use caution whenever you get the bad feeling. The reason why I say there may be some fear that comes up is because the moon and sun are squaring each other. That's a 90 degree relationship out in space. What it comes down to literally is the two planets can't talk to each other in a square relationship, so fears do tend to bubble up. Now the two areas you might have fear around are something about your profession and something about marriages in life. That includes business partnership marriages, marriages to yourself, relations. You might be afraid of certain relations going on with you and your profession. Nonetheless, if you do have fear come up, Taurus, that's a good thing because you want to get rid of that fear. Fear is the only thing on the planet that blocks the light. Fear does not even exist in the light. It's just a twisted game we play on Earth, and it is also how people control us. So get rid of the ability for fear to live in you, and you will not be controlled. Now, I do have some good news. Venus, the creation vibration, and Pluto, the destruction vibration, are now coming together in a conjunction. What that means is... We are all in a very powerful place to create and destroy our lives simultaneously for the next 30 days. Watch how fast the Earth changes in this 30 days. I think this is the wrap-up of the Pluto-Sagittarius issue for good. And what Tauruses are creating and destroying is their sex life, their, the way they connect to other people, the way they connect to the other side. It's now time to create an entire new policy on intimacy and where your boundaries are and launch it at the same time. All right, Torah, that's all I got for the day. I'll see you tomorrow with your weekend forecast. Live, love, be. So...